Okay, all of these vlogs are starting off so ugly. I look disgusting. It's after like a full day of being on a train in this same outfit that we still haven't watched. <laughs> I'm sweaty, my hair is greasy, I look terrible, but we made it to Venice. I've already seen some of this, but there's some that I haven't seen. So here's the first impression. Here's the kitchen slash living room. Look at the fridge is right here. What the hell? Oh, sh The bedroom, I think the main bedroom. Oh, this bathroom is so nice. Oh, there's another bathroom over here? How do you work the lights? Why is it green? Okay. <laughs> this is, there's like hanger closet space. And then this is like a tiny little room for like kids. <laughs> it's so cute. My back is gonna hurt by the end of this. Dude, my head's gonna hurt. Just a little hideout. <laughs> and then here's the other bathroom. Wow. I haven't seen this yet. What is this? Why can I, what? It's so weird. I can't walk in here. <laughs> so like in the kitchen next to the table, there's like some steps up and then you can open this window, which is literally this tall. Like my head, it's not like a door, it's literally a window. And we have a balcony overlooking one of the canals. Bro, why are we on the top? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I need to shower though. Okay guys, we quickly showered and I got ready I got like fully ready into this like nice dress because it's warm here And I don't really have like shorts or skirts I brought like two skirts dresses are my best option for when it's like warm weather and I don't really have any casual dresses So we're stepping out <laughs> 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 we are stepping out. Oh, here's Noah's face. I'm just wearing regular <laughs> sh and you're dressed up to the mat. But I want to go get a picture before the sun goes down and that's going to be quick. And then we're just going to walk to a very close place to eat. And then I have to come back here, edit an entire podcast, and post it still today. By the way, I forgot to record the first two staircases, but we had to lug our big ass suitcases like this. I don't even know if you guys have seen the suitcases because I haven't really vlogged this traveling, but my suitcase was 58 pounds. It probably is more now, even though I haven't bought anything. It feels heavier than I did. But Noah's been taking my suitcase. I've been taking his because it's a little lighter. But this is like, I'm still walking downstairs. We walked a little bit. We're just kind of, we're not like looking up any places to eat. We're just going to kind of walk and see what looks good and then look it up and look at the reviews just because, I don't know, that sounds fun. But this bridge, I don't know if it's like the main bridge that people talk about, but it's huge and it's Gorgina, Gorgina view. Okay, we just sat down at a restaurant. Hope it's good. Everyone just has like the same stuff, so it's hard to choose. Got an apple spritz, got some bread and dipping, dipping oil. Oh, I got a beer. Mmm, that's really good. Spritz, spritz, spritz. Oh, it's so good. Our food came. Pizza. And pasta. Guys, <laughs> 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 this pizza is so good. Hey guys, we just ate dinner. It was really good. I don't know what the place was called. It was really good though. We got, I showed you what we got. It was fire. Now we're in a supermarket. We're gonna get like snacks and stuff for the room, for the Airbnb, and like maybe some waters. Yeah. And you're drunk. I'm so tired, and I really have to edit this whole podcast right now. Oh. Hey, guys. Oh, is that light? It is laundry time. This is the first time all trip so far that we've had a washer and a dryer at our, like, access easily. In Paris, there was a laundromat, like, across the street and down a little bit. But the whole bed bug situation happening there, we didn't want to risk, like, washing our clothes where everybody else is washing their clothes. And finally, we have a washer and dryer, and it's free in the building. This is all of my dirties from the last, like, week and a half of this trip. I don't even actually know how long we've been gone. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, is he? Press like a button. Can I don't want to like f*** up your sh I don't know how to start it now. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Never mind. It's awkward. You got that? I just want to clean my clothes. I know, so. I want my sweatshirt clean so bad so I can just put it on. I don't have any clean sweatshirts. Good morning, everyone. I, it's not morning, it's like noon. This is the current situation. I ate my leftover pizza. It was like a whole half and I just started taking bites out of it. We also got grapes last night at the supermarket and they are the best, crunchiest, sweetest grapes, like the most perfect grapes in the whole world. I ate a bunch of those. So I guess my breakfast this morning was leftover pizza and grapes. 
this aesthetic though kind of fire i forgot to show you guys this but we got two different kinds of chips last night at the supermarket just to try one of the bags we got we literally finished in like 30 minutes because they were so freaking good so many of the places we've gone we've seen paprika chips so when we saw them at the supermarket last night we were like oh we should get those to try them because like we've seen them everywhere and now i know why they're everywhere they are the most addicting chips ever they're so good we walked like five minutes to a little brunch place so now we're here this area is cute now we got an Aperol spritz. I didn't know we were ordering drinks at our breakfast meal, but I we thought got. you were gonna be like, oh, we're just gonna get water, and then you started ordering drinks, so. It seemed like a, like a brunch thing. Okay, I got the mixed berry fluffy pancakes. They're jiggly. And then I got a side of bacon, which I'll tell you a funny story about in a second. And then Noah got the fluffy pancakes, but he got like a more savory version with like bacon and eggs. I really wanted bacon, but I really wanted this one. So I asked for like a side of bacon. And I think it, they like made fun of me for doing so. I just go all over my dress. Okay guys, it's been like four hours. We came back to the room. We did all of our laundry. It took so long. Like I had to put my clothes in the dryer two separate times. Noah had to do like the same. It just was not dry. But we're going right now to this pasta. It's called like I love Italy pasta to go something like that Here You pick your noodles and then you pick your sauce and then you make your own pasta <laughs> We came back to the room to eat. It was only like a four minute walk There is like 75 flights of stairs in between that so it kind of prolongs the walk But we got our pasta to go and we figured it would be better to come back and eat here on our balcony Because I don't think you're like allowed to like eat just like in public here I already taste tested this and I forgot to record it, but it is really good. It just tastes like kind of a bacony Spaghetti, it's good mm -mm -mm. Okay guys, we're walking down our alley. We're going to get cannolis. We got a chocolate one, we got a tiramisu one. Why are you always yeah, yawning? I'm so tired. Here's what she looks like. Her. Bon appetito. <laughs> I can tell if they're stale or if it's supposed to be like that. Yeah, could definitely be a little stale. Tastes good though. Hello guys, it is the next day. It is Friday, October 13th. I just took a shower, got all ready. It's 11.45, so again, not a super early start to the day. I found this place online that looks really good. They have like breakfast sandwiches and like kind of more standard breakfast because everywhere that we look up that's like breakfast is just like croissants and coffee. I need more to eat than that. Also, it's more like brunch now, so if it was like 9 a.m., that'd be good, but I need like a full meal. Sorry, there's a chair in the way, but here is the outfit. I feel so weird wearing sneakers with a dress, especially like a nice one like this, but I just cannot wear sandals or like other shoes that aren't comfortable for walking because we're gonna be walking a lot today. Oh God. <laughs> Everybody that I see is wearing like skirts and dresses with sneakers like no matter what they're wearing They're wearing sneakers for the most part. There's a few girls that pop out in heels We made it to where we're eating where we eat we're eating right here at this L33 place. The view is so pretty. It took us like twice as long as it needed to to get here because our phones were tweaking. It kept taking us down like the wrong alleys and they would be like dead ends. But we got to see a lot of cute areas. Okay, my juice and my toast got delivered and my cappuccino. Okay, I've eaten most of this. I just got my scrambled eggs and bacon. This is Noah's. This is the biggest burger I've ever seen. It's like a breakfast burger and we got more toast. My bread and stuff was very good, but I'm excited to eat these eggs. We're gonna take a little gondola ride. I think they're like 30 minutes and they kind of just go through like all the little canals and stuff. Hey guys, we're at the castle palace thing. <laughs> Tell them what we're doing or no? Walking around in a giardini. <laughs> uh huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we hopped in a Gandhi. <laughs> we're in a good Dorito Skeeto. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hey, how'd we end up here? <laughs> Super cheap drinks and the dude fleeced us. What I've noticed about being here is the people outside of like restaurants and stuff will just stand there and they'll be like, table for two, and it's like, and then they're, and like, then come, they're come. like, come on. And then he's like holding up a sign with like happy hour prices for these drinks. And we're like, might as well. Like, we're we just, planning yeah, out we just, Okay, we got the three different kinds of the spritz. Campari, and this is Hugo, and this is the Aperol. This is good, not as good as the orange one though. Okay. That one's super good. This one's the most refreshing. This one tastes the best. This one's kind of ass. Very bitter. Ooh, I really like that. <laughs> I don't really have much to say, I agree. You agree? I agree with Noah's statement. This one's the most refreshing. This one's really bitter and has like a weird taste to it. That one's really tasty. Yes, one each. Uh, one each. Yeah, yes. she gets one, I get one. <laughs> it's been like a minute and a half. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we put those suckers down. So I'd like drink here, and then I'd pass over here, and then she'd give me this one, and I'd drink it, and then we just like had this rotation going, and we just killed all of them in like a minute. <laughs> Okay, we just got our second. This is the Hugo Spritz. This is our favorite, we got it. Time check, 6.12. All right, there you go. <laughs> Time check, it's 6.13. <laughs> okay, we've decided to finally eat. Oh, I'm taking a video. We've decided it's finally time to eat and we've been craving sandwiches all day. So we're at this place called Farini and we're gonna get sandwiches. I saw online, I typed in literally Caprese sandwich near me because there's Caprese everywhere here, which is like the salad, but I want the sandwich version so bad. So hopefully they actually have it. Okay hey guys, so we walked into that shop and online, like when I typed in Caprese sandwich near me, it was the first one that popped up. And when I type in sandwich shop near me, it's the first one that popped up. We get in there, they only sell pizza and like pastries. So I don't know what the f is going on with the. Okay, here is pizza. We both got pepperoni. pizza. Okay, we got Nutella ice cream. <laughs> Uh, gelato, Oreo, and Nutella, a scoop of each. It is bussy, bussy. We just got back to the Airbnb. I'm not exactly sure like if we're just gonna like be in for the night. It's currently eight o'clock. But first thing, I'm gonna do a little haul. First thing is from Venice Duck Store. There was a big duck store in London too. I got this duck. It is so freaking cute. It says, I love pizza. He's got a little mustache and a little Italian hat and a little pizza in his hand. And if you guys don't know, if you have like a Jeep Wrangler, there's this thing called ducking and you basically just like go around to like other Jeep Wranglers and you like set ducks on their like door handles or on their like windows. And then you like collect little rubber duckies on your dash. And I have a bunch of them. And now I had to get one from Venice. I should have got like a London one too. Maybe I should have on ducks in every place but then I wouldn't have been able to find a duck in like Lugano so I got a little ducky and then we went to the supermarket just now we got some stuff for the morning and some snacks for tonight we got some yogurt for the morning we're doing this because we don't really want to get up and get breakfast tomorrow because our train is not early but like it'd be easier to just eat here some strawberries we each got a chocolate chip muffin and then we each got a caprese salad which is just lettuce with tomatoes croutons and mozzarella we got paprika potato chips last night I I'm pretty sure I talked about them and how we finished them super quickly. We got two more different kinds. And then also what you guys are sitting on right now, we got paprika Pringles. There's something about it. At first it doesn't taste that good, but then when you take, like when you eat one, same with the potato chips, like you just want to keep eating them. It's so good. Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday, I believe. It's so sunny out here. We are about to leave our Airbnb and head to the water bus station. And then our next stop is Florence. I'm so excited for Florence. We have kind of like some day trips planned. So we won't only be like in the city by our hotel and stuff. Ew, this week is really pissing me off. I think we're gonna try to go to Pisa for one of the days. Um, Cause I think it's like an hour train ride. And then also we wanna go on like a wine tour in Tuscany like in the countryside. So we'll see if that all happens, but you guys know the drill. Um, if you're interested, stay tuned for next week's vlog. I know it's been a lot of travel vlogs and I appreciate you guys all that have stuck around and watched all of them because this is truly like so exciting for me and Noah. Like I've been talking about traveling Europe like this for years and the fact that I'm like actually here doing it is just so surreal. Like I can't even process like where I'm at at any at any point in time. So I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching this video and I will see you next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>